So I thought the way you leave a server was kind of boring, so I made this. Whee! And then you'll actually leave the server. Well, your game will crash, but you'll actually leave the server. So I've got Notch here to demonstrate for me how this looks from the outside. And there he goes. Now this may not actually be Notch, but I guess you get the idea. So here's how it works. The pressure plate is connected to these four command blocks. These command blocks over here will set these blocks to dirt, as you can see. This command block will teleport you in the middle of the pressure plate, so you won't get stuck in the blocks that get set to dirt. And the last command block will set a block over there to a mob spawner that will crash your game when you get too close to the spawner. The way this works, it is trying to spawn pigs, however, it is trying to spawn pigs with age set to 5999. When you use it like this, it will be attack short, though pigs should have attack int. When they have attack short, Minecraft will crash. Go home, Minecraft, you're drunk. Anyway, these repeaters make sure the signal gets a bit longer. Then over here is a clock that spawns a lot of creepers with a huge explosion radius. Though as long as your game rule mob griefing is set to false, it will not damage your world. And then there are a few more command blocks over here. This one sets the block back to air, so it won't crash your game when you get back over there. And these command blocks set the dirt back to air, so you can get back in. So yeah, that's it. Pretty cool if you just want to leave a server. Or perhaps you just want to annoy someone and make his game crash every time he logs back in. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this video. And of course, thanks for watching.